Howdy guys, welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Trigger! My name is Nintendo Capri Sun. For, uh, wait a minute, Ugh, my screen's messed up, there we go. Yeah, for you Brad, I've got five! Oh. I was just looking over my most discussed videos. You know what's crazy now? Is my top four videos, the ones that have the most comments, are all videos I posted in the last two weeks, even though I've been here for like a year and some odd months. What the hell's going on here? A gate all of a sudden? And a Lavos spawn comes out of it. Ooh. Well, this one's pretty much just like the others. Attack the head, not the shell. But before you do that, for the love of God, if you charm anything in this place, if you only charm one monster in this place, let it be this guy. Because you can get two excellent things from him. One from the shell, which is a safe helm. And he does counterattack that, so watch out. <laughs> oh. Oh, wow. That's, uh, that's not good. I probably should have healed up before I came in here. Wow. What the heck? Was I like... Oh, my God. Oh, oh, and she's out of magic. What timing, what timing, what timing. Here, revive Chrono. I probably should have, like, well, eh, whatever. Yeah, I know I did that in the last video. I had Isla refill her own magic instead of having someone else do it so that she could do her turn right away. So yeah, whatever. Don't you just love me living on the edge like this? Or as Weird Al might say, living in the fridge. But, whatever. Now we charm the head. And what we get from the head is even better. Better than the safe helm? Yes. Oh, uh, <laughs> Okay, go ahead and attack the head. He'll live long enough for me to do it again. Man, if I actually don't die, that would be so amazing. So epic indeed. Uh, do it again. And charm. He didn't attack the shell, did he? Well, he's probably just doing this randomly. Oh, for crying out loud. How did I know? I just had a feeling. Well, Luca's got both auto safe and auto shells. That's why she's made it this far. Hell. And, she, and she's got counter attacks. So he's kicking his ass over there. Alright, you know what? Here. You do the charm again, and you do a full tonic, I guess. It's the only problem with this party is we got pretty much nothing for healing, except for Isla's kiss. There it was, haste helm. That's what you get from the, uh... Ooh, from the head. So, you got a safe helm and a haste helm here. Definitely want to have both of those, because they're both extremely useful. As you may well have imagined, I mean, auto-haste and auto-protect two excellent things to have. I'm not even going to bother to try to bring Chrono back, because knowing my luck, he's going to just so happen to come out with a needle attack right after I do it, and then it's like, well, screw that. It's a little bit tougher than the ones we fought on Death Peak, as you may have noticed. You know, I've changed my mind. Oh, I don't have any revives anyway. Okay, never mind. Well, this shouldn't take too much longer here. I mean, it's... Uh, I had all those counterattacks, and I was worried it was going to kill him before I got a chance to charm the haste helm, and now he's kicking my ass. Do you mind? There you go. That's how it's done, baby. Okay, he should be dead now. Well, he's counterattacking because he died, right? <laughs> Thank God. I was going to say. Good job, Luca, surviving that. Jeez. I always knew you were a survivor. Now, let us heal up. What do you say? This is going to take forever. Let's cut away. Okay, here we go. Of course, I'm not really interested in getting to the end as fast as possible. Man, I thought that fight was never going to end. I was sitting here all day, and it was like, oh. Alright, shelter. Beautiful. Had a little sound desync in that last video. I don't know what happened there. It was just in the game sound. What the heck? I never understood this. Like, what is this? Is this like the Espers in Final Fantasy VI? But it's not quite, because I'm right here. I mean, I've heard of Chrono clones and all, but that... But now we have a clone of everybody. Luca over here, and Robo, Frog, Isla. Is this just your visions? I suppose there's a lot of different ways you can interpret that. This looks like a... A shattered mammon machine here, actually. 
and it's the queen. Behold, my pretty destiny in its most brutal form. All the dreams that might have been, all the happiness and sorrow you might have experienced, gone forever. For you, there will be no tomorrow. Yeah, we already heard this from Magus, okay? Yeah, so the Dark Omen is waiting for Lathos to awaken, and Destiny has led us here. No, I seriously doubt that. You want to talk about Destiny? Well, you're going to lose. That's your Destiny. Hmm. Come, dear friends. Perhaps I can persuade Lavos to share his dreams with you. Did I say dreams? I meant his eternal nightmares! The boob shot again. Okay, so first things first, charm, as always, because... And what did you think? Oh, crap! You know what? Okay, where's the lapis at? I need to bring these out. This is all the healing I got right now. <laughs> I don't have any kind of multi-targeting heal spells. I really should have brought Frog in here. Mega Elixir. Okay, so now that we've done that, so we don't have to worry about that anymore. We'll just start hammering away with attacks. Aside from the attack where she takes you down to 1 HP, she's really not that much of a threat. It's the boss after her that you gotta worry about. If, I, if it's the one I think it is. But I think there might be one in between, I forget how it exactly goes down. So, I would use Falcon Hit, but the only real appeal of that is the multi-targeting. Otherwise, it's nothing too special. You might as well use Volt Bite. At least there's a chance your elemental will kick in. You can see we're doing pretty damn good either way. We'll just do a bunch of different crap. There she goes again. Well, lucky thing I got my lapis here. I mean, we've been picking this up all through the game. Might as well use it. Plus, using items is not as time-consuming as using magic. I think you get your next turn faster if you do use magic. Ooh, there she goes again. She must be panicking. A lucky thing I got someone's turn coming up here to use items. Oh, look at that! Are you kidding? No way! Arg, my powers don't seem to work here! Wait, I'll simply toss you into the Mammon Machine! You'll be one with the Omen, Lavos, and me. Oh, so you want me to join you? Is that what you're saying? Because, uh, that's very weird. Ooh-wee. Okay, it's the Mammon Machine. We get to fight the Mammon Machine now, can you believe this? And you get to start with 1 HP, that's just lovely. I'm going to use two of those, just in case. No, I'm going to use three of them. And now I'm going to start with the, uh... Start bringing on the pain train here. Actually, I'm going to do a test run here. And see just what... You know, see if this guy's as resistant to physical as what we've been seeing. Yeah, we're so massively over-leveled that I don't think we have to worry about it too much. But, yeah, physicals work. Man machine stands still, huh? Well, let's give you a fire whirl, see if that doesn't wake you up. Ooh, that was a cool-looking attack. I imagine most of this stuff would normally be doing in the hundreds, at least. But, you know, because I had to go and be a dipshit and over-level, oh well. 3467, beautiful baby. He's not doing anything, I'm not sure why. Being that he's a machine, though, I imagine Vault Bite would probably be a pretty good attack to use against him. So let's try it. I don't think he really counts as a machine, though, because you're, he's practically a sentient at this point. Jeez. Yeah, 25, 22, whatever. I mean, electricity does pretty good damage to human beings, too, from what I hear. At least I've seen the Green Mile, I can tell you. Can you actually charm? Let me just make sure. So I didn't actually check that out, and it'd be stupid if I'd been so good about charming and then missed, like, the best thing that I could get. Well, it doesn't even matter anyway, because I... I charmed that, you know, safe helm and haste helm, and I didn't even equip him. So I've been too lazy. 5,000 damage. Oh, and he releases the stored energy. Let's see what kind of stored energy we're looking at here. Oh, man. I thought for a second that was going to do, like, 600 or something to everybody. I was like, dude. But if that's all you got, I might as well just keep hitting you with the 5 grand. You know. See you there? Not even the Mammon Machine can stand up to us now. I love that shot right there where it looks like we're sinking down into the water, because that's kind of what we're doing, I'm pretty sure. I and mean, Lavos comes from underground, and so to be one with Lavos, you kind of... You know, listen to me changing the pronunciation of Lavos every two seconds. Boy, what is this? Whatever it is, it's epic as hell. Wow! 
We are on top of the Black Omen. You can see the planet down below, and it's just so epic. I don't know what that moon is supposed to be. Maybe that's Mars. Maybe you can make a wish on Mars. You cretins. I plan to live with Lavos and control the universe forever. You will not get in my way. Indulge in such regrets in the next life. What? What are you talking about? You know, in the next life, it wouldn't matter if you indulged anyway. Oh my god. This boss is insane. But I am out of time, so... Oh, I'm not really out of time, but I kind of am, so... You know, I'm close enough to out of time that I should stop. Does it, is it just me, or does it look like she's trying to flip us off there? I don't know, dude. See you next time.